There is a new update in a cold case twist. Who can forget on Thursday, Ricky Davis, a man wrongfully convicted for the murder of an El Dorado Hills woman, was allowed to go home after spending 15 years behind bars. Now, the same DNA evidence that prov proved his innocence led to the arrest of a new suspect. And today, for the first time, we saw that suspect, Michael Green, appear in court. Cameras were not allowed inside, but ABC 10's Monica Coleman set in on that hearing. Michael Green was walked in with handcuffs to the El Dorado County Courthouse today for the murder of Jane Hilton. In 1985, Hilton was found dead with stab wounds and a bite mark on her shoulder. DNA evidence led to last week's arrest of a new suspect in this case. Michael Green was a teen at the time of Hilton's death. Because of that, the El Dorado County District Attorney's Office is starting this case in juvenile court. It could get moved to criminal court next month. Today, Green's attorney didn't comment on the case, but DA Vern Pearson says Green's arrest is a vital part of finding closure in this decade-old case, especially for Hilton's daughter, Autumn, and the man wrongfully convicted. I mean, we take responsibility for uh, when the system and our part in it and, and my office's responsibility, although I wasn't the DA at the time, or wasn't even in the office at the time, but still, it's my responsibility to to right the wrong that happened to Ricky Davis uh, and happened to Autumn and the other participants and the way they were treated back then. Today's court appearance was brief, but Green's family and friends were in attendance saying that they loved him, but they did not want to speak on camera at this time. 